Hi guys, uh, I'm Always Meet the Weirdo and this is going to be my first foray into Football Manager 2020 as a uh, little bit of a let's play. Um, basically, I am looking at Hansa Rostock at the minute. I'm not sure if this is going to be the team that I'm going to do. Um, my initial thoughts were to start this, give it a test run and see how it goes. And then, if I do okay, restart it as a let's play. But then I thought, why not just dive in where I am, show you where I am, and then maybe look at a few other options and um, see which one either you guys, or if, if I don't get much response, I will just um, pick one after giving a couple a try. Um, at recording them and see how well I do because I'm mindful that um, things could go a bit wrong on occasion. Um, I'm doing these saves in um, leagues other than the UK, other than, um, should I say, other than the English league because the English league is obviously what I know. Um, but hopefully we can get something um quite useful together so i'm just going to show you where we are at the minute so we are sixth we've been hovering around the top six all season and um, the only team to beat us is Colne, who are just behind us um and um yeah i'm looking forward to uh getting into this game i'm right on the cusp of a game here i'm trying to experiment with a different formation um uh, a bit of a disclaimer from my football manager playing uh, skills i'm back on the game from a, a maybe a, an eight year gap um there's a lot more depth in the game these days and i'm still learning a lot of it um but for me, I really enjoy, uh, really enjoyed playing it back in the day. Um, best luck I had was either on I think it was Championship Manager two thousand and three, or Championship Manager three, and it was um, taking Arsenal to four um, Champions League titles in a row um, and five Premier League titles in a row. Um, at that point. I thought, well, there's nothing more I can do here. I've done everything and I stopped playing the game. Um, and then I maybe had a few um, good runs with Huddersfield Town, which is my local team. I took them to the Premier League on occasion on like earlier football manager, uh, fo earlier, uh, earlier versions of Championship Manager, uh, which is obviously the predecessor to Football Manager, uh, the same game. So let's get into this um i really feel like i should be able to find better players for this i don't really know maybe i shouldn't go with this like I'm not really having much luck I think that's the best I'm gonna get yeah I'm not, like, I really am, like, um, a bit weak in midfield compared to where I'd like to be. But I just don't have the options. Um, let me just, I just want to share something, actually, because I just, um, this is something that I, I, I'd i like people's thoughts on um, if I did the right thing in this situation. Because I, I'm a Liga 3, Bundesliga 3 side. Um and if you look at the transfers, ooh. huh? 
little bit. Here we go. So, this guy. I didn't want to let this guy go, but he wanted to leave. And... I, uh, yeah, I had to sell him. Um, so you can see, 375,000. He's now worth a bit more than that, but not much. Um, like, don't want to sell. Yeah. So, he did want to go elsewhere, but they came in with the first offer that I was willing to accept. Um, but I'm not, yeah, I'm not liking this. Um, anyway, so, I'm not going to dilly-dally any longer. I feel like I could talk for ages and not get anywhere. Um, I'm half tempted to bring this guy in instead of... Um, see, that's the problem. Like, I feel like... Hang on, let me... If I put Volman up here... Has he got a better... Yeah, and then I... Put Brea... Out... For Sonnenberg... Uh, for Thomas, even. And then... This guy can be automatic... This is a guy I signed before having to sell um, my star central midfielder. And he's nowhere near as good. But I feel like, given the opportunity, he could break into this first team fairly early. With Especially with the fact that I'm playing a central midfielder, not got a central midfielder available. Um, I'm just having a look at... Yeah, right. So, um, we're at home. I want to play positive. I feel like this is a good way to do that. Um, right, we'll, we'll give this a go. Um, I will confess, uh, I have I haven't really done it on this save. I haven't reloaded. Um, but I'm not averse to doing that as I'm still learning the game. Uh, so do apologise if you're not a fan of people who reload the game. I, uh... Just want to crack on. Right, let's... I just realised I didn't do the opposition instructions. Right. So let's see how we get on. They might let um let's, uh... See if we can um, create something here. Oh, penalty. Nice. Very nice. I didn't expect that. I'm just going to turn my volume down on my headphones because I'm mindful I'm shouting. <laughs> Oh, I've got an injury. Oh, no. Apparently, this is the guy. Um, natural. Oh, well, that's a little bit more hopeful than I expected. I didn't expect him to be natural on that side. Nice. Let's see if we get what we want on there from him. 
right um, so if you're wondering what I'm doing there it's asking it's giving me tips on what to do um, and I'm accepting those tips for the time being as I said I'm fairly new to the game I know that not everybody just does everything the assistant advisors and what have you um, but 1-0 at half time is pretty good we'll, we'll take that I'm not a massive fan of um, Oh, it looks like there was a collision there. Uh, not sure. But anyway, so... I know you're capable of even better. Um, Volman again. I need him to be better than this. He's the weakest player fitness-wise on the pitch at the moment. I feel like it was a good decision to bring this Thomas in. He's doing okay. He's not the best, but... It'll hop. Oh, there... Ooh. How are we getting on? Um, if I... Um, I don't know what to do. Uh, demand more. think oh no let's see if there's any opposition instructions that I can add yeah oh look at that that was jam that was jam I'd be happy with a draw but not particularly happy really you do want the win when you play in this right I feel like making a couple of subs here might be a good way forward Volman I don't want to get us oh. so I'm going to do that and then The, uh, maybe we don't need to uh, anywhere across defence ok I often find I'm never usually one to sub my defenders off um, it's very rare that I do it, so... Oh, fuck. Um, yeah. So, 1-1. One, one, um, we'll be happy that they couldn't hold on to the narrow win. Um, I'm quite happy with a draw. It's better than a loss. Um, right. We should have done better. We should have held on to that lead. Um, like I said, they're, they're not the greatest. Now, my predicted, fix, fix, bleh, my predicted finish is eighth. Um, I'm hoping that I can finish in between three and five this season. I think that's a good aim. Um, for me, but I do feel like I need to, um, oh my god, he was, in pre-season, uh, Aaron Apoko was, Apoko was the best player on the pitch every game in pre-season, he was brilliant, um, So he's just signed for FC20 and they've sent him out on loan to us. I never understood that. It's like, why would you... You want to have a closer eye on, but maybe maybe it makes sense. Um, player injuries, the club's vision and objectives. Okay, I'll attend this press conference and uh, we'll, we'll have a look at how I handle these. 
Um, so injured himself in the match, and it looked potentially during a, a couple of, can't. Um, okay, yeah, we'll do that. Um, I I don't really like um the media interaction that much. I feel like it can easily be con contrived in the wrong way. Um right, so elsewhere close range head up convincing win da 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 right remains positive yeah Ingolstadt uh, I really don't know I think um, So we have got Thomas in there again. Um, so let's crack on. We might end up, what I might end up doing with the format of this is I think I'm going to go with um, two episodes, uh, two um, matches. Uh, as it seems quite common, um, I'm currently watching uh, uh, a let's play of um, Football Manager, and uh, the person is doing a um, two, doing two matches, um, and I think that's quite a good um, many better options in the squad. Oh, excuse me. But anyway, so I want to. Oh, no. No, so I don't know whether it's hair fever or dust or allergies or whatever. But anyway, so um, let's crack on. I don't know what half of this. I kind of know, but uh, yeah. Stay on the feet. Um, change that tactical from our tactical style right so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go into the tactics here because I think there's a few things I want to iron out um, so I want to go with um, much shorter passing and then I want to um, change that then I want to go to this and I want to go with that and then I want to go here yeah done and I want to go here oh, oh I click it twice then this maybe with that um right i'm just making slight tweaks to my tactical setup here 
Um, one of the reasons I'm doing it is because I feel that if I was to not... Oh, God, why is he... Uh, uh, right, hang on a minute. Right, so... Recommend for upcoming match against Dingle Stout, we should play with a defensive mentality. Okay. I'll accept that. one thing I want to do um, I read something about mentoring um, well I watched a video on mentoring and I wanted to look at mine and see if I have um, a lot of options right so Hans Lake influential player fairly determined right remove him Players fairly determined. Ooh, significant, right. Um, so that. Yeah, okay. It's not. So I'd get rid of him and who's he going to add? He's going to add Lucas Scherf. So Needs to be someone in this group that's going to benefit from that. And, uh, um, Okay, so um, let's crack on. Um, oh, this guy's not be a useful signing. 88% and only at 56. Can only play in one position. Poor first touch. Da -da -da -da. Acknowledge. Don't really feel like we need to do any more with that. Give him a boost. Let's give this guy a boost. 
first training excellent because what I want is um, I want to try and build build the squad's confidence up so that they can bounce back from this recent slump um, obviously we lost to Colm and we drew to a team that we should have beaten really um, I've got my eye on a couple of players um, I believe if I remember rightly in the I think Benjamin Bruckner is one of them. Um, and, um, obviously, Julian Thomas has been brought into the side a little bit earlier than I planned, but he's an under 23. Um, and I don't know if you won't be able to see it, but we might just be able to see it. You, I need four players under 23 in my lineup. Um, I think that's something that the UK could benefit from. Um, but I don't think it'd work, especially in the top clubs. Um, but yeah, so it's a, it's a good start here. Let's let's give this match a go. Um, right, what we got? Uh, winger um, support. I feel like... Maybe I want to play this guy instead. Position instructions. I put an emphasis on the fans personally. I think that's sometimes a good thing to do. Great. I'm ignoring that because I'm pretty sure we should be already doing that. Let me go in. Yeah. make that and then what we want to do is time to get creative see if we can see if we can create something oh look at that we've got a yellow card for their team which is always a bonus gets them on the back foot right um Being the better team, um, something's not quite working though. I don't really want to draw again, but I suppose this is more realistic draw than the last one. Right, who's not having a good game? Right, the strikers. Uh, I'd, I'd quite like, um, let's go into the tactics actually. So if I take this guy off, where's that guy, Junior Thomas? Yeah, he's not. So oh, not really getting. Give him the opportunity to come in, and then we'll see if that. Oh, I'm not liking this. They've. Oh, nice, nice tackle. Oh, 
Now that was a goal. I was I was watching that. I was oh, I was quite impressed with that. Look at that. He just, short passing, picking his spot. The keeper wasn't ready for that. Come on. Keep possession now. Keep possession. Back up where I want to be. So this is a big win. Oh. His second yellow card, he's off. Right. I feel like I want to make a sub. And I feel like resting this guy is a good shout. So I'm going to rest this guy. And then I'm going to switch to a balanced approach, maybe. Oh, well, there's no point, is there, with have Nice. Nice victory there. Uh, and that was a beautiful goal. I think I made the right decision putting Osman in the team instead of Brea. Or Briar, or however you say it. Any Germans in the chat, I'm sure you can. Uh, any Germans in the comments, I'm sure you can let me know how you pronounce it. I did study German at um, at school, so I should have a slightly better than if I was doing, say, Greek, a Greek side. Just checking what's going on. Got a few messages flying in, so I'll deal with them after this. But yeah, pretty good. Um, well done lads good win like to see that we can pick up those wins when we need to um, obviously at Ingolstadt I thought there was higher up than that but um, um, we were fortunate to beat them but I think we deserved to beat them we played better than uh, we kept possession, we pushed them back. I think we did really well. Um, if there's something I missed, let me know. Um, right. What are your thoughts on Duisburg parting company with Torsten Liebrenecht? Um Yeah, I don't think it's my place to comment on stuff like that. So, Osman Atilian, I think, is um, someone who I need to give a little bit more credit to. He's on loan from Dynamo Dresden. Um, a beautiful goal. Um, I'm glad to see him back in the team because I've been bringing him on from the bench quite a lot, um, I believe. Uh, up until this point but yeah so that is that that is that is a good start a good video to start us off with hope you enjoyed it um, I'm always be the weirdo and um, I'm not entirely sure how frequent I'm going to plan on doing these videos although I will say that this initial sort of risk this initial uh, video that I'm doing now I will probably do another one straight after I get it ready uh, to upload so that there's some content coming through. Um, but yeah, again, I have got a couple of other saves on the go at the minute that I might put on there as just, ooh, look at what I'm doing in Football Manager. Um, what do you think? Is there any particular um, team that you'd like to see me do uh, more content on? Or is there a particular league you want to see me have a go at? Um, as I said, the CF I'm watching at the minute, he's doing the Greek League. And um, it looks like quite a tough challenge for him, but he's doing really well with it. And um, yeah, I'd quite like to do some um, football manager and get him back into the game. And I think it's a new game to the channel. It's not something I've ever done before. I have done the odd bit of FIFA and... Um, wrestling but this is this is relatively uh new i'd quite like to 
know your thoughts and yeah hope you enjoyed it i would always mute the weirdo this being football managers 2020 and i'll see you in the next video